In this video, I want to show you how to set up MIDI remap inside Studio One. Let's dive into it. So I have this drum part programmed with addictive drums. And I now want to use this with Bogren Digital Crim drums. If I just drag it down here, it's not going to work. Right, the notes are different, it doesn't work. So what we need to do inside Studio One is create a new instrument track. And let's call this MIDI remap. And also, of course, I'm going to make it purple. Then open your instrument browser and add MIDI remap to the new track. So now I'm going to choose addictive drums as source. And in this case, I'm arming for Bogren digital drums. Now simply drag the drums you programmed onto the newly created MIDI remap track. Then on the track of the new library you want to use, simply choose MIDI remap as MIDI input and enable monitoring and that's it. If you can't see the MIDI input, it's probably because you're zoomed out too much and you have to zoom the height. Or another way is to go to information and there you also can change the input of the MIDI channel. So probably most of the time that might be enough for most people, but if you want to go into detail and now proceed programming drums with the new library, simply record enable the track and record your drums. If you have a long track or a long song, simply set up high BPM so it's, the process is going to be faster. So now we have those drums transferred to the new track with the notes translated to the right values for the new library. And you can make any adjustment you want to do. Also, if you wonder why I don't have to do this stuff, simply head to midiremap.com and download our awesome drum maps for Studio One. Thanks for watching.